Hi, and welcome to another edition of Fishing with T. Today I'm gonna to demonstrate how I get my tandem axle trailer into some pretty tight spots. I, I personally put my boat in a garage, and I know there's a lot of fishermen out there that, that probably try to get their, uh, their tandem axle trailers in some pretty tight situations, maybe like through a gate or something like that, but they're really hard to maneuver once you disconnect them from your truck. Well, I've come up with a solution for that, and I'm gonna share that with you today. If you, uh, if you enjoy this video and you want to see more informational videos like this one, please smash the like button and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Let's get started. Okay, so here's the secret. This is called a vehicle positioning wheel dolly. Uh, you can pick these up from several different manufacturers. You can buy them online on Amazon. I got mine from, uh, from Harbor Freight Tools. These are made by a company by the name of Daytona. They have a 1,300 pound capacity per dolly. So they're really heavy duty and they can pick up quite a bit of weight. The reason I chose these two is number one, they have, they have metal, uh, metal runners here instead of plastic. I've seen some of them out there that are a little bit cheaper, but they made these out of plastic. So I don't know how well they're gonna hold up. I like these because they're actual metal. So I think they're really gonna hold up well for me. One thing you wanna pay particular attention to if, when you're buying one of these, is a lot of times these wheels, the wheels themselves, will not have bearings in them. They'll actually just have a metal sleeve in there, so they tend to bind up. Make sure you have ones that, make sure you get ones that actually have bearings in the wheels. So that's kind of important too. Now, what I do with these, first of all, is that you kick up this little kickstand here, this little kick, uh, little foot, uh, uh, foot unit. You spread it out, and you put it around your tire that you, want to, that you want to lift up off the ground. Then you got a lever here that you just position this lever in the up position and you just step on it. And when you do, every time, each time you step on it, it lifts it up little by little by little until you get your tire up off the ground. Mine takes five clicks to do it. That's five clicks right there. My, my front tire now now my back tire, just my front tire now is about, about a half an inch off the ground. Now my, my tandem axle trailer has now become a single axle trailer, so it's a lot more maneuverable than it was. Okay, so as you can see, those uh, vehicle positioning dollies really work really well. You actually want to, you want to get two of them, one for each of your uh, front tires, or you can even use them on the back, whichever you prefer. Depends on how much room you have to play with. I put my Percy on the front tires. Also, keep, on, keep in mind, too, if you bought four of them, you could move your trailer side to side and all different directions if you really wanted that much maneuverability. If you bought four of them, put one, each one on each tire, it would really give you a lot of flexibility. I don't really need that much. All I needed is for the front, just so I can get the, you know, get the front end to move around a little bit so I can get it back into my garage. If you enjoyed this video, please smash the like button and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. See you on the water.